We're talking with Jordan Siebenhaller with the uh, Carroll Tigers, the third baseman for the Tigers. Uh, Jordan, not an easy position to play. Ball gets on top of you fast, especially here, because you got to kind of almost play in at the edge of the grass because it takes some strange hops. How do you adapt yourself to getting ready to play third uh, base every game? You get used to it kind of after a while. It, they, all the balls look kind of the same, but they're never easy balls, really. They're hard, and, but you get used to them a lot after you play a lot. What do you consider to be your strength uh, at, at playing third? Um, just like reactions, like playing soccer, it's the same kind of, it's the same thing to do, just reactions kind of. Defensively, how did you feel you played overall in this Carroll Invitational? Uh, okay, I think I had one ear, um, but that'll happen from time to time. But okay, I thought everybody played pretty good. You appear to me to maybe be one of the quiet leaders on, on this team. Are you a little bit more vocal uh, off the field maybe than what we see on the field? Yeah, I'm not too loud. I let other people do that. But, um, uh, yeah, everybody is a pretty fun team. But I don't know. I'm not one of the main leaders, but it's fun to be. Talk about uh, hitting the ball. A couple of walks here in this game that got ended earlier. But uh, how do you feel you're swinging the bat right now? Well, way better. I'm swinging on the first pitch a lot more. Uh, not waiting to get like, down on the count. I thought everybody played pretty good. What did you see uh, out of the pitchers over this weekend and especially here tonight in this uh, fifth place game? Uh, this, this guy tonight, uh, he struggled a little bit at first. He kind of got in the rhythm. But uh, the first game, he, the pitcher they had was their ace. He was really good. And uh, I thought we hit the ball pretty good for what we see, saw. But tonight, was, we didn't get a hit lot. We got a lot. Now, you guys lost that opener yesterday to Logan, a heart, heartbreaker. You came back last night and got a win. How important was that to get that win last night and get yourself another game today? I thought it was really important. It would be bad if we didn't get to at least the second day in our own tournament. But uh, I thought the first game we put came out really sluggish. No one wanted to be there. And the second game we came out pretty hot. And so it was pretty fun. What's the strengths been of this team so far this year? Uh, we have a lot of seniors, so leadership and just not like pouting if we get out or something. I think just staying um, happy with it. Just having fun. A lot of guys that played last year, how much has that experience kind of helped you guys? Can, you got off to a great start this year. Mm -hmm. It's, it's big. Uh, most of our infields, I think, have played that for a couple of years now, so it's, it's pretty fun if you know like everybody who's playing. And we're all friends in the infield and outfield, so it makes it easier to work together. Any stories, fun stories you can tell us about this team that maybe people don't see you know, out there on the field, but you guys do to, yeah, I was going to say, it's got to be an appropriate fun story uh, if you can tell us anything. I'm not really sure. It's just everybody, we joke around a lot and make fun of each other, so, but it's still fun. There's a lot of just joking around it. So. Well, Jordan, I appreciate you joining us here. Good job so far this year. You've been kind of one of the quiet reasons why this team's had a lot of success. All right. Thanks.